Hello and welcome to a video tutorial showing you how to move objects with your keyboard in Google Slides. My name is Tyler Osborne. So right now I have a slide here full of desks and I'm going to show you how to move these objects only using your keyboard um, just so you can get them really fine-tuned. Sometimes it's a little bit easier to do the fine-tuning with your keyboard than it is with your mouse. So I have all these desks here. I'm really hoping to uh, make like a, a classroom scene with them. So all I've done is copy and paste them on top of each other. First, I'm going to move them kind of into place with my mouse. So it's easy to do those big movements with the mouse. There we go. So they're kind of in the spots, just kind of getting them close. There we go. All right, now you can see that it's not quite right. This desk right here is too high. Now I could be fiddling around with the mouse, but I'm going to get a little bit frustrated with it. The easier way to move these things is actually with your uh, arrows on your keyboard. So if I use the down arrow, I can move it down. So it's in line with the other desks. And if I use my side to side arrows, I can, um, I, I can move them side to side. Now, what if the jump is too big? So when you're pressing these arrows, it's actually jumping about 10 pixels, and that might be too big. You can really fine tune the movement if you press and hold the shift key and then press the arrow. See how the movement is a lot less now? So let's just try and move these desks so that it makes a better scene here. And I'm gonna use that fine tuning. There, if I wanted to add in some students now, this would really sell that effect of looking. Now, as you can see right here, my desk is a little bit too high for this, but if I jump down, it's too low. I jump high, it's too high. So this is when I'm gonna use that fine tuning to make it look just perfect. There we go. This one's a little bit too low. That's about right. And I need to move this one over more. There we go. So I'm just using my keyboard uh, to, to fine tune those, those placements. It's uh, going to save you a lot of time. It also will really reduce your students' frustration when they just can't quite get that, that object to be right where they want it, especially if they're using a Chromebook. Um, sometimes the trackpads on those Chromebooks aren't very, very good. Um, okay, that's all you need to know about moving things around without uh, using your mouse and Google Slides. Thanks for watching.